This episode of Another Dirty Room is brought to you by Squarespace. Start your free trial today at squarespace.com slash ADR or use the code ADR at checkout to get 10% off your first purchase. Rick, you took your hand and you took your actual hand um, out. <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> you put a razor mark, Chris. <laughs> what do I do? God. Hey everyone, this is Dan Bell, and welcome to another Dirty Room. On this episode, we're still rocking out in Cleveland, Ohio, and checking into the Lancer Motel, a vintage one-star, three-floor flophouse located on Carnegie Avenue. Let's take a look at some of the reviews. Over on Google, Guardian Angels Leader says nothing good here. It's only good for sex. This place is absolutely horrible. Doug Benson says you get what you pay for, and that's $20 for an hour. Samuel Thacker says first class, just a very basic motel. No Wi-Fi, no amenities, but streetwalkers, hookers, and drug dealers abound. Andrew Miner says I called numerous times for pricing and room information, and I kept getting hung up on. Makes me wonder if they would ignore the needs of a person staying there, or if they ignore the daily needs of the hotel, such as cleaning and maintenance of the property. Gee, you think? So what's the deal with the Lancer Motel? Is it as bad as the reviews are saying? I mean, would you run out in horror after checking in? Well, sit back and relax because we are going to find out. Lancer, 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 the yeah. Lancer. Different vermin have pupated under my skin and inside of the <laughs> rectum. I'm gonna need to have them Lance. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh, I see it. It's up there. See, Lancer Motel. Uh, yeah. Oh my. The sign right looks ahead, a little bit rusty. Again, just keep going. See that white and black sign there? Oh, going. okay. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, oh my god, this place is abandoned. Oh my god. This place looks abandoned. Look at the boarded windows. Like what? There's like five windows on that whole front wall there. Yeah, but it's not abandoned, I don't think. No, I, there's one I car. See, I, I, see, see, I think I it's a car. Abandoned. I see like satellite dish here. I feel like we're in like a demilitarized zone, like the it buffer looks, zone. It looks like this is the kind of shit you put up to keep the yeah uh, the car oh bombers God. away. God, this is the office. Jesus. How much is a room? Just one night. Huh? I don't know if you like this room or not. No, we'll be fine. I booked two rooms, room 336 and 337, at a rate of $55 per room. At least they have electronic keys, that's something we're not used to. Oh my... I I just... You sink like a foot when you step Oh my god. Oh, it's horrible. Wait till you see the bathroom. Hey everyone, this is Dan Bell and I want to talk to you about Squarespace. If you're struggling to figure out how to build a website, look no further. It's so easy and the templates are so beautiful that your friends are going to be like, who made this site for you? And you're going to be like, I made that site. Just to show you how easy Squarespace is, Rick Sarah built his own Squarespace site. They have 24-7, 365 day support. They're flexible for any kind of website, whether you're a musician, designer, artist, if you have a restaurant, or anyone else. So please, by all means, go check out Rick's website. And also, Squarespace is offering my viewers 10% off your first purchase with them. You just want to go to squarespace.com slash ADR or click the link in the description to sign up and start building your online presence today. Squarespace.com slash ADR. Receive 10% off of any purchase. Hey boys. Put the, you on the truck. Brennan is teaching Rick how to 
Uh, how to Instagram. How to Instagram. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Okay, and I'm gonna move over here because we have a wonderful <laughs> storm coming. Wow. This is the only nice thing about this room. That. You're also good at breaking things too. Well, but I can fix them after I break them. Oh, okay. okay. Well, as long as you can repair them. Rick the repair man. No, I wouldn't say that, can, but can you fix right, this? Let's start place? Rick a man who can repair things. Can you repair this place though? That may be a little bit too much to do. So the tile go is gone here at the doorway. Yeah, one's cracked, there one's is, gone. There's no transition. I mean this look. one's loose. Like oh, yeah. oh. Okay, I'd, it's no problem. They're all, they're all going to be. It's the, like the grout is just see, gone. But see, it started here. There's, there used to be a, a tile transition here, and they got broke free. So it's slowly going to knock everything free. Yeah. Because people will do that. Oh yeah, that's horrible. That one's cracked underneath your foot there. And also, water gets under the tile, and that helps them to pop. So that's it. And then you have plumbing problems on that edge over there. You can see there's been moisture problems. Looks like it's the toilet <laughs> flange. And you can see like a dark trail behind the toilet here to the left side. Oh. I love how you're not even going to mention I, I wanna, the two smoked cigarettes on the floor. That, but you know what that dark trail is? Uh, fecal matter. That shit that's going. Yeah. And it's not going down. Yeah, it's because. It, so. Excuse me. Oh yeah. Let's step back a little bit. Yeah, the septic. I want to take a look at the toilet before we oh, do other things. No, oh my. That's fucking disgusting. Doo -doo I'm sorry. Has been you uh, left. I'm sorry about my profanity, but look at the. There's shit oh, all over the no. lid. Yes. Piss all back here. Probably some vomit. Yes. That is shit. That is. Actually. Actual crap that they left in the toilet. I would agree. There's some hair here. Hair. That's disgusting. I love it. It's just so crusty. It's got like some cubes that they that shaved. Stuck on there. Who would want to sit on this? Like I, I'd need like 8,000 sheets of toilet paper yes. before I'd want to feel uh, clean sitting no, on no, this no. toilet. This, this is the first time we've ever, I've ever checked into a motel where the owner Dude. said, you're not going to like it here. <laughs> he was trying to force Dan out. He's like, please, please don't, don't stay, stay here. here. And I was like, oh, this must be a great place. <laughs> I love it. Oh, no, it's great. It's, we just wanted something it's, cheap. It's He's ADR like, time. Yeah, it's <laughs> like, you will not like it. Oh, I'm sure we'll like it, I mean, sir. the fact that they don't clean their toilet is pretty spectacular. What, what even is this? It's, it's, it's a like, label that for all the way back from when it was bought. See? It's a no, band-aid. It's, band it's a band-aid cover. Oh, that is oh, I think there's a band oh, God. I think there's one in there. Oh. Let's see something first. I'm surprised. I thought this would move. All right, so it's, it's pretty fastened well. It's fastened well, so I mean that's disgusting. That, yeah. I've never seen anything so bad. Like, I'm so unfortunate. It's this really is the worst toilet we've ever seen. It's really unfortunate that we just, just blatant. Ate. Like we're not cleaning. We're not doing All anything. Right, so here is the again <laughs> the so, toilet paper. This is what you're given to start. A little bit of toilet paper. It's been used. It's a partial. They rolled back up. Look, there's even oh, there's some brown stuff. Browning on the toilet paper. Oh, Jade, Jade again. The Jade Soap Challenge. There's two, Rick. You know, one no, for no, me. Jade Soap is very popular here in uh, Cleveland. Cleveland. We've yes. one in every single motel pretty much. Yes. yes. We don't need any more Jade Soap tests. They're horrible. It, it smells bad, but it does make both of your breath <laughs> very fresh. Better. Smell very nice. <laughs> well, it actually flushes. <laughs> We're so surprised. That's incredible. Let me tell you. Oh my, that's disgusting. That is... But did anything actually leave the tank? Yes, it did. It cleared it out. Wow. But all the wow. all the crap residue still It just left made. everything else. Yeah. But, but it took that band-aid. It looks like somebody's worst Taco Bell night. <laughs> right there in that toilet. Oh my God. Gosh, it's so... Rick, well, be careful what you put in your hand. That's definitely feces. Yeah, that's something smeared there. I have my, Somebody my put fingers the crap. The stable mine. And this is probably urine. See the yellow? What about behind me? Look at these marks What? Here. What is this? No, seriously. It's shit. It, I think so. It's Unless it's either shit or blood. But I think it's shit. What's this up here? 
That's piss. That's that's, somebody sh that looks like urine. They or shot urine. piss up there. See, look at the door here. Look at that. That's probably blood. See the red? You that see on the door. That's a bloody finger. That's somebody's finger. Maybe. Look at look at these stains. They're. I mean, They're, did, how someone, they get... did someone shit themselves or something and wipe it on the wall? <laughs> it's horrible. All right, so we're seeing. We were talking about the brown spots here. And we're gonna see if we have any uh, right in there. luminol activity. All right. So let's give it a try. Ready? Mm-hmm. There's a teeny a spot. Bit. Teeny spot. Teeny spot. Is that metal though? Turn the light on. Turn the light on. We got no. 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 There's some stainage here, Rick. Mm -hmm. Let's give this a squirt. And Rick see. found uh, some food under the the sink. sink. <laughs> He's <laughs> now eating it. How does it taste? How was it? It was the other. Uh, uh, Nature Valley um, granola bar that I had eaten one of, and I stole it from Jake. I gave it to him. Well, thanks for ruining that joke. But I, <laughs> uh, I see this nice. That's urine, I think. And then down by the toilet, look at look down yeah, at the. Look at look at change. Look at that. It's like it's like that's disgusting. Oh my god! All the way to the towel. It's horrible. <laughs> it's never been cleaned. Uh. Well, when do, Rick, when do you honestly, when do you think this was last cleaned? Man, I don't know. I mean, it's maybe once every three months. I, it's three, I think it's longer than that. All right, so looking at the sink right here from the top, I noticed that... It's coming apart. It's coming yeah. away. Is there something, it, what's that red thing underneath that? Is that like... Oh my, that's, that's definitely that's, a cocaine that's straw. That's a cocaine straw. Yeah. Somebody just stopped it under there. What in the hell is going on with this sink? I think this, oh my this that's a little like, that's a little roach. That's all that is. What? Oh my god! This fuck. So this, all this coming out here is just this pressed wood falling apart inside yeah. here. No big deal. Oh, no, no big deal. <laughs> I want that. <laughs> it looks like somebody was having a cigarette while going to take it, a lovely shower. Uh, or bath. They, they must have smoked a carton. Yeah. I mean, seriously, they did it multiple It was a times. long bath. Yeah, long you sit bath. down in the bath. I don't know who would want to sit in this disgusting tub. They, oh, oh they, that's Jesus. blood on the shower curtains there. It could be, but there's so much brown stuff in this bathroom, it could be poop too. All right, we're doing a little shower rose here, which is where we bunch off the bottom of the shower. And you can you see it's see a lovely- That's disgusting. It's, it's a lovely- It's like dark and it's all- It's it almost, brittle. It's a lovely pink rose. It almost looks like the it, the same color as the tub itself. Because <laughs> it's been rubbing on it. It's just been scraping off micro amounts of the I, I think it's here. also just bacterium too. That's great. You use that term. Yeah. So when we show you the bottom, we call it rosing. The or, shower curtain the rose. The shower curtain rose. Yeah. I really am I'm pushing for a procedures manual. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Entry. Oh, this is nice. That thing is literally going to fall it's, off. It's literally... The it gasket is, looks like it's not even attached. See? It's, it's literally the Is piece. that the gasket? That's Yeah, it's cracked off. It, that's going to leak like crazy. It will. It has no draw, so you literally have to crouch underneath the shower head. You have to let hold like, it. It's just going to sort of do this. Uh, the shower curtain. Oh, <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! I'm shit. Oh my. That's some good pressure. But here, let me turn it off. But yeah, it looks like, look, it looks like whoever painted the shower drain just <laughs> spilled a bunch of paint and just wiped it off I and you can see. the mildew is trying to <laughs> escape emulate the paint color so you don't clean it. <laughs> I like the lovely copper blue deposit here. Copper Yeah. Blue. None screw it. Oh no, it's just the settings. It's totally, it's, it's, anyway, look. Let's get the hell out of this Yeah, room. I'm ready to get the fuck out of the bathroom. Okay. Please. Um, oh no! Right. Well, there's a big Looks brown like, stain uh, in the I middle. I have uh, evidence of uh, ass wiping and rubbing because it was itchy. Oh my god! And look at the bed sheet right oh here. God. Is it a hole it's or just is a, it a stain? It's burning. And the sheets are wet. This is wet. Oh, I can feel the dampness too. Yeah, the pillow even felt wet. Might have just been from being freshly washed. I I'm can sure. tell the pillow. Freshly washed. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, 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 it just came off the clothesline in the <laughs> yeah. prairie. Oh yeah, they my just... My pillowcase is a little too short. <laughs> my <laughs> pillowcase is a little too big. I wish I had the one right in the middle. <laughs> Goldilocks. <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. That is That's... horrid. Oh. 
I can smell it from here. It smells musty. Like the whole American globe. Lung Association. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, the other side looks pretty bad too. Like look at the black spots on the pillow. And here too, that could be maybe some blood, some bed bug. Yeah. Somebody had a cut on that the is neck. That is just No, that looks like that looks like sperm again. Oh, this one actually looks pretty nice on the outside. I can't. Oh, well, <laughs> never I mind. Mean, I mean, that is the nicest pillow. Even though it's gross, it's the nicest one I think we've seen in Cleveland. Well, wait, we haven't seen the second side yet. Wait. Just a, th a thread, I think. Okay. Not horrible. Oh, That's a bit of blood, for sure. Fresh, fresher too. I, it hasn't... I think it's mango. <laughs> okay, Rick. Okay, Rick yeah. being very optimistic. Thinking it's mango. I mean, th these mango. are like new mattresses. This is incredible. Yeah. Just a little bit of uh, a little bit of dust and stuff. This is just looks like probably something from a, a cigarette or something. No, 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 wait a minute. Think is it a bed bug? No, it's not. I c actually, I don't think it is. No. Okay. I'm trying. We're we're looking at a mattress that's just been replaced. In the middle of a room that's just absolutely abysmal. The, the room's horrible, and they got this... Nice mattress. Like, I was nice. scared to sit on the bed because of the appearance yeah. of the room, but this is actually not bad. Like, I might pretty, take my break and lay down. Pretty amazing. Wow, I mattress. can't believe it. But back is clean. Yeah, the, there's oh, one little... Except, the, there's just the a the stain down there, but that's nothing. Yeah, that you get out of... Out of like Jesus like the bed is actually in decent condition that's well you never so know we did see a bed um, out by the dumpster that they threw yeah, out probably cause because this bugs. is why we're seeing all this diatomaceous earth they had bed bugs in here so they probably took the bed bug mattress out and put this new one in yeah but it looks this that's is a clean kudo kudos to them for changing the bed when there was bed bugs I mean I'm sure other rooms have bed bugs and they just didn't change the bed but this one yeah. at least they did this is a uh, uh, just a place where people go to secretly have rendezvous. I think more than it is for drugs. No, we found we a, found a, a crack pipe of, under the carpet. Well, maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe they do they do the drugs, but they're not really drug dealers or anything. The maybe place maybe, maybe they are the, drug dealers, and they just like need there's a place been a to drug related stuff. shooting in the parking lot, Rick. Maybe I don't know. What I'm talking about. <laughs> it's so damn hot, I'm ready to pass out again. Every episode. <laughs> It's about when this brick going to collapse or have a stroke. <laughs> All right, what's next? Diatomaceous earth. Diatomaceous? Diatom. So you just say diatomaceous. Oh, diatomaceous. Diatomaceous yes. earth all around. Yeah, this one looks a lot fresher. And then there's some some shots looks like injections and squirting. From Injection my head. shots here. I feel like we were just a week or maybe two weeks short of finding bed bugs I in all the close. beds. Like I feel like they just they started addressing here. the issue. They uh, got it clean. They put this down as a left place treatment. They may even have changed out the mattress. Or mattress and box spring since uh, that all happened. Yeah, who knows? So we don't know. I wonder if this bed will be as impressive as the other bed. I love how spread out the pillows are too. There's just some browning on the end, the end there. Not too yeah, much. Yeah, I don't see any burn marks. Well, there's a little bit here of staining. Yeah, not nothing more. No. Oh, a huge one here. All right here. Yeah, huge burn all there. right there. That was a good start. Oh my god! That's the pillowcase. Wait a case. minute. It doesn't even have a pillowcase on it. No, that is the pillowcase. That's the pillowcase. That's disgusting. You've so, got to be kidding me. Compared to the last bed, Dan, I don't think this is a new bed. So Why, I feel like it, there could potentially be bed bugs still in Why the bed. did they just not change the... That's disgusting. And this is the way it was. That oh. Is, that is horrid. But if you turn oh it over here... Oh, my God. Oh, my... They just flipped the pillows oh over. Oh, my That's all they... Oh, my God. Yes, that, I think that is happen. horrible. I don't even think yep. they changed the sheets in this room. Oh, my... Like, look at all this dirt and disgustingness. I feel like the other room, we got lucky because it was a new bed. We got to smell the pillow. Do you think it's like With this? the paint. Just smell it and see what it smells like. Oh, my God. Just... Oh, it just smells must Stale. musty. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's just, it's not piss. It's just musty sweat. It's just musty sweat. Yeah. Oh, okay, All right, Rick. let's pull it open. If this is how bad the <clears> pillow watch the pillow looks, inside be a perfect yeah clean. 10. 
Oh, oh my god. god. Oh. The tag is yellowed. Look at the tag. Flip it over. Oh my. That's disgusting. Jesus. That is just horrible. Horrible. That's just all sweat from previous people sleeping on it, and they didn't even bother to change the pillow. I am it's really itching. My gosh, I'm itching like I haven't normally this, itched for a while. The good thing is, though, this place is really giving me the, the itch. The old well. room we had a new bed. This room, I feel like it's in, it's the same bed, so maybe potentially we could find some bed bugs. We'll see. It is lighter. Oh, no. oh, it's, oh, always it's a, a double pillowcase. Double pillowcase. The case. classic twice the fun. Classic double pillowcase technique. Here. The Here. Russian nesting dolls. Oh, there it I is. Mean, is. As opposed, I mean, it's, or as compared, it's really protected. It. Yeah, compared to this, that. No, I, but you see, this is an even pillow. Wait, this is wait, the pillow. wait, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. The stains on that pillow. Love that. Pick that up. That's disgusting. Okay, someone sat their dirty ass on that pillow. Oh yeah, those are cheek marks right there. But but this is the thing. This oh. is the kicker. Oh. This isn't oh. even the actual oh. pillow. They sewed a, a pillowcase over this. Oh one. wait, no no no. There's oh, a, it's zipper. a zipper. That's why. Okay, I didn't see the zipper side. So it's a third pillowcase. Oh, this is really so much fun. It this is, is it's a Christmas. It is Russian Russian Christmas. nesting pillows. Russian nesting pillows. Yeah, right. What the? Wait a minute! Now. What? Okay, I mean it, it's disgusting still, but it's, like it's a little dirty. But, but why it's... wouldn't they just have this instead of those three gross pillowcase layers? Why is water wet? That's a very, very good question. <laughs> why is up up? <laughs> why is up? Why is up up? Yes, that's a good question. Greg. That'll make you think. <laughs> Oh, oh my. no! There's the moisture we were feeling. Oh, oh I put my, my hand God. on that. It's the ring of pee. And then there's, oh my! There's a macaroni and cheese noodle. <laughs> Their last meal. <laughs> that is oh, disgusting. It's huge. That is a big bedwetter right there. Some drunk ass. How the hell the... do you pee that much, Rick? <laughs> um, you drink. You drink liquids and then you have them come out of your body i think it's yeah but that's like an incredible amount of urine yeah that's somebody has a big bladder Maybe huge they, bladder and drank a lot at a party you think it was several people in, and you stand there and you stand there and you stand there you stand there and we'll all just pee ready one two three. Oh. thank you for that that's image. beautiful thank you for that image, god Rick. it's a piece of artwork no <laughs> <laughs> I'm like repulsed right now. <laughs> hey, you should have been. Oh, no, it's not that bad. No, not so the pee did not even go no, through. Well, no, through. it did go through a little bit. It went through. Yeah, you can still oh my see. Oh gosh, it went through. So Isn't that's why sad? it was soaking wet when we... <laughs> oh. At least it didn't leak under the box springs too it's much. It's a beautiful pillow top. Hold on for a sec. Mattress? Yes. Here's a bed bug. Oh god, okay, I'm getting off the bed right now. Smashed and dead? Dead. But it is a bed bug. There you There's go. Another, one, another one right there, Dan. Wait a minute. It's alive. There it's a live bed bug? It's alive. What do, so, Rick, explain what we're seeing here. <laughs> I don't know what the hell. It's a bed bug, Rick. You think it is? Okay, well. I. Dan, get, Dan can get his phone and do a close-up. It looked exactly like the bu that bugs is a in Detroit. Fucking bed bug, Rick. Come on. It's a round bug. There's one down there as well. Dan, get Where? your get your phone down here at that one. Okay, I think you might be right, but I wish he was more a uh, little more, you know. Well, once we lit this thing up and behind here, we're going to I'm see sure it. there's a colony somewhere. I've, I've, all right, I'm going to leave. Look, this. there's the flecking all oh. around this. Yeah, just this leave it out there. Mattress. Let me get down from here. It could be living behind those panels. Uh, th th these are called cove base. Instead of a baseboard, it's made out of vinyl. And you glue it on instead of hitting it on with a nail. We really should try to use the proper name of the construction material, etc. That is actually everybody else's word. We'll sound like we actually know a little bit. So okay. let's try I'm to... I haven't seen anything there. No. Maybe on this mattress. I, you know where I think it's going to be is behind the headboard. 
I don't know. I don't see anything down here, though. Well, I do have something. That's just a gum wrapper and gum, right? Yes. That's a cigarette wrapper. Oh, it is. That's terrible. <laughs> that is just awful. Careful, check the wood underneath the... Uh, there might be something in that corner there, Rick. That corner of the headboard. I can't see it from this angle, man. I'm well, like you know, too far away. I'm wearing glasses. See, there's a little like speck. I don't know if it's a bug in the top corner. Right there? No. I don't know what it is. Oh, okay. It could be. Could be a, just a little bit of glue. What's that on the wall? That's a bed bug. On the wall there, center. I think yeah. that's a bed. I'm pretty sure that's a bed bug. It is. It's alive. Okay. So unless they, I mean, obviously they put. A new mattress in so it could have been that the colony was on the other mattress and then these are like the stragglers who weren't in the colony when yeah, they but why would you do you know anything about bed bugs why would you put new bedding in and not put it in covers that it doesn't make any sense no. so yeah, it, it's because be all they're going to do as soon as those bed bugs feed they're going to they're, they're going to multiply like crazy and then this bed will be have to have to be thrown out so it was a very lazy extermination yeah, yeah. job I mean, yeah. you know is the one trying to feed off the dead one does that appear to be what it's doing you know what it, it's possible i like was wondering do they feed on one another it's if one's dead and it still has fresh blood in it, it probably, oh my god that's right if it has blood in it maybe yeah. it's and they're hungry if you put that one the one that's not on the dead one you put that one on there on your arm it'll feed This is like the ADR initiation here. Jake's done it, Rick's about to do it. The only people that haven't done it are me and Dan. I was hoping we could do it. We have another one here. I know, but that guy's dying, I think. And he looks like he's full. This right. guy probably won't feed on you, Rick, because he he's looks full, like he's- He's eating. full of the dead one. Okay, so bring your arm over here. Oh, yes, yeah, so Jake. Get down close here. So I'm going to put the one that's the rambunctious one here. Yeah, right there on the ledge. On your arm. Oh, God. Fuck. Fucking shit. That's creepy, man. This is the most creepy thing. The one guy looks like he's trying to eat. He just can't. And you never felt anything when you got fed one, you thought, right? Never felt anything? I mean, once it was set. In place. Can you feel anything? I feel this blue thing pushing against <laughs> my skin. <laughs> <laughs> so now, here, just put them on this uh, thing. Literally, the floor. Look at it. It's like going up and down, like indenting. But so Jake went to lift this carpet up and look. There's a nice present for you all right underneath here. Look, a fucking oh, crack pipe. Crack pipe. With crack still inside. Is there a crack in it? Yep. Just pull what? it out. What? This one doesn't even look like they burnt it or smoked it already. Yeah, so there's probably crack it. still in there. They probably dropped it and lost it before they could smoke it. Dropped it and lost it. That's disgusting. All right, just throw it in my bag. <laughs> we'll give it to Rick as okay, a Christmas wait, present. Wait, wait, someone left a ashtray. A nice cigarette box <laughs> for us. That is disgusting. <laughs> it's like the smoking section. And here's this this phone, and the phone works, which is the most amazing thing. Okay, you can hear. Yeah. I'll put it up to the mic. You can hear the dial tone. I can't hear anything. Is it picking it up? Oh wait, I'm you not wearing headphones. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering when you were gonna put them on. <laughs> Anyway, look at the look at the, no, no no it's fine we already got it look at the inside look, look. it's disgusting you don't don't touch it Dan it's look disgusting. at that who would put that up to their ear it, it's been it's been resting in that and you can see here, there's like here. chunks on it here let's dial the uh, front desk. no don't they charge just hang up we're not doing that tonight <laughs> you're not <laughs> asking if they have room service. Ah!
god! Oh I my fucking god! <laughs> Isn't that lovely? That's disgusting. You're letting me out, man. You just crushed it. Oh. Yeah, oh, look no, at all yeah. this hair, Jake. I <laughs> oh. oh no. <laughs> Poor Jake. Rick, are you having dinner? Oh my, please don't. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Uh, what are we doing now? We, you were eating your tobacco oh, salad. Oh, we're just having a little bit of yeah. tobacco salad. Toss, toss, it's a motel salad. Toss salad. <laughs> <laughs> A motel toss salad. Um, <laughs> that could be so a new wrong. phrase. Yeah. It's a new phrase. <laughs> the motel toss salad. <laughs> wrong on so many levels. Okay, so we're looking up right now. I'm just going slow and we can review the footage after to make whoa almost fell off. <laughs> make sure there is. Leave him. I'm why do you have to fuck with Brennan's ass and stuff? It's the first time I've done it and it was fun. That might be something. We'll review it after. I can't really tell too much. Mm -hmm. Now he's looking around over the suspended ceiling using this camera and feature of the iPhone of Mr. Dan Bell to see if we can find any suspect. I'm pretty sure that's a crack pipe. A possible crack pipe sighting now. <laughs> now if you just keep Thank twirling you for the narration, around, Rick. we're going to see if anything is Oh, in there's something the for center. sure. Something big over something there. Something big, something big over there. But it looks like a plastic bag with something in it. Okay. Oh, that's always a good thing. We might thing. find like somebody's stash house with like thousands Another plastic of bag. Of drugs. I don't think it's money, but... We're taking a bite out of drugs and crime right now. Okay, so here's the plastic bag. Doesn't look like much. I don't know if there's something in there, but I didn't want to squeeze. What is that? Oh, that's that's crack filter. Oh, there's a red bag in it. Oh, oh that was parts of a crack pipe. It's like an unboxing. <laughs> <laughs> it's an unboxing. This is the ADR unboxing. It's like a present. Oh. It's like a Christmas present. There were a lot of clumps of that filter up there. This copper wool is used to stuff in holes around pipes to keep mice from moving around to prevent them from spreading in your yeah. building. But, but I mean, also, because we found the crack pipe. But they, 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 they probably find this. I mean, they're so, I don't know if they, maybe they buy it. Or maybe they find it, they pull it out of where it was stuffed, and they use it. I don't know if that's what they're doing, but they're finding where to buy this copper wool instead of regular old steel wool. And we still find steel wool, as you've noticed, mm -hmm. in ex expeditions. Expeditions. All right, so, Brennan, you, earlier on you were looking up Yeah, in the I was ceiling. standing on that nightstand table right there, for, and I just peeked from the corner. And I saw what looked to be a syringe and some suspicious looking materials. So we shall see what uh, okay. what is up here. So I'm just gonna steadily move this back, trying not to disturb anything. Yes. And I'm gonna show you guys on this video what is going on. And oh my God, yeah, that's definitely a syringe. Trays below you. Oh. There it is. So it might have some opiates still on it. Oh, here's something. Oh, wait a minute. What is that? <clears throat> I just saw a little. How bite. the fuck did you see that? I thought it was just a, like a, a roach. That literally is like. That's I pulled it down thinking it was a roach, but What'd then. You say, Rick? It's heroin. That's heroin. Yes. You think so? Oh Absolutely. my god. Yep, that's heroin. But is it enough to get home on? <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. I literally was just checking the tile and I was just like, okay, I'll just check this last tile to be thorough. I looked around and I thought it was just like a roach thing. So like a right. part of a joint. I don't know why they'd stuff that up there, but then I grabbed it. Yeah, I mean, I would have just thought out. that was some debris or something. Yeah, I know. Wow. It's just a co accumulation of ash. Pieces of that copper for crack pipes. Yeah, it's uh, disgusting is what it is. Just absolutely repulsive. 
Careful, right? Careful. Look at it all. Oh, Jesus. That's disgusting. Oh my god. Get the idea? Yeah, that's a lot of uh, dirt and build up from the. Good work, Rick. <laughs> we come out here, slowly twist this out. Yeah, you're clear. There's like just little cigar bits. Gatorade cap. Another penny. A fingernail. So they must have removed the collar. Is that a fingernail? Oh my god, that's somebody's toenail! Oh no! Oh, look at that! Oh, oh no. that's somebody's toenail! Oh my god! Wait, oh my turn it around. That's oh, disgusting! Wow. And that's, that's right behind your nightstand table. The worst oh thing I've God. ever seen. That is a wretched looking toenail too. Oh yeah, my that is crusty. Oh my God, it's horrible. I love how Rick just so nonchalantly put it up there like there's a toenail. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you know, it's a toenail. <laughs> Yes. We? Yep. So this is your rating for both of the rooms. Yep. No difference looking at one and looking the other and comparing. All right. So yeah. I actually did take the time. Oh, individual. To individually look at each room. Okay. And summarize. Room three, three thirty-six down here. Okay. The bed I give a four. All the right. The bed. The bed. It was the best. Without bed. the linens or without with the, the linens, without, just the okay. bed. Just the bed. But the room is a negative three. Yeah, the room is terrible. <laughs> so I end up with a net score of one. Okay, so you gotta show the board. So the second room, the bed got a score of zero. Anytime I find bed, bed bugs, bugs, right? The bed is out of it. So that added one. That was a zero. Oh, okay. And then I gave them just to be nice. I gave them a one for the room. Okay. It had good air conditioning. That yeah, it I did have good it air conditioning. We came in here for breaks. This room was cold as an ice box. Yeah, not clean. And it but saved cold. us working back and forth. Yeah. So this is a one. So I have a tie, Dan. A tie. A tie. Brennan. For me, I gave it a hard one for both. <laughs> and my my reasoning is because they had the uh, the di diatomaceous earth. diatomaceous earth all around. You should not be breathing that in. That's both rooms. Toxic chemical. And the rooms were filthy, disgusting. The bathroom, remember, there was crap. The bathroom in the next. The bathroom in three thirty six was absolutely horrible. The worst thing I've ever seen. The we power had... didn't even work at first. There was no channels on the TV, so you're not going to do anything. The only channel on this TV was porn. We didn't actually right. show that in the video because we don't want to get demonetized, even though we probably will be. And there was bed bugs all over this room and disgusting crack bugs, even... heroin. It was just. More basically, in 336, there's actually leftover feces stuck inside it, the it, bowl. Inside yeah. the fucking toilet. Between these Disgusting. two rooms, there was the full ADR bingo, minus you eating a uh, bar of soap, buddy. No soap. But you had it all. But we had, <laughs> we've been seeing the same brand of soap in town for all the places we went to, so I want to say... Thank yes. you yeah. to Jade, Jade Soap. Jade, yeah, Jade Soap. If you ever find some to Jade clean Soap, up town, yes. Thank you, baby. Jade's a very popular in Cleveland. Jade Happy today we got Jade! Yeah! Jake, what's your rating? It's a one. Okay, I'm gonna give it a two. What? Oh! No, I'm just kidding. Okay, I was like, no. <laughs> I'm You're the most one. strict out of all of us. He, the, he actually said one plus one. Both bathrooms are awful. We didn't show the bathroom in 337, but it's basically the same with a cabinet. <laughs> broken, broken floor yes. tiles. Uh, the toilet's clean, but there's just 
horrible. crap and mold, and oh. it's just awful. You had to hold the handle for the toilet to the flush. flush. Yeah. It's just um, horrible. And the bathroom in 336 was just, uh, in my opinion, completely unusable. I think the Lancer proves that this is what and you don't want to sleep in at night. I don't think yeah. we mentioned this at all in the uh, during our whole video, but th this place was actually used as a FEMA shelter at one point. So people who lost their homes in a natural disaster were sanctioned by the government to come here, here. and live in this Wasn't that room. nice? Oh, I think so I'd sorry. rather stay in my destroyed rubble house than uh, live in the yeah. room the like government this. government's great. Instead of Katrina, you know, you had your house destroyed in Louisiana. Uh, Louis yeah, Anna. and you have to come live in this Instead, dump. you come all the way up to Ohio <laughs> yeah. to live in this garden town. It's in your right hand. Put it in the damn cabinet. Okay. That is, I mean, seriously, it's like poison. They're introducing into the cabin here. It's bug spray. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rick. <laughs> <laughs>